GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Imperial Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zeli, and we're here today doing the Alpha 11 series of the uh, Invader Defender scenario. Um, we found the trading station out in space, and a whole, like, like, look at my map, it's crazy. Now, the weird thing is, is you look up, up on the upper right, my radar, my little mini map up there shows a crap ton of resources, but then when you go into here, it's like, where are they? <sighs> they still got a lot of work to do with this. It's it's really buggy that way. It's like it doesn't show up show everything on the small map here. Um but that's okay. At least you can navigate, you know where it is, so you can steer towards it if you've marked it on the map. Um because you can't actually tell where it is here to actually put a uh, an actual marker on to guide you. So um, keep that in mind when you're discovering things and you want to go back to it. It's not necessarily going to put it on your uh, the prop the map properly. So mark it with a uh, marker. That way you will get guided back to it properly. Anyway, in the meantime. We found the trading station, so let's go. I got some weapons cooked up. Let's go do this. We need to sell more gear, right? So let's get out and do that. Got my EVA on. Yep, got my EVA on. Let's uh, got drill on. That's fine. That's not offensive. Can't kill anyone with the drill. Okay. Get in here. Oh, we could use the repair station. That's nice. Don't really need it yet. I'd rather uh, repair when, when it when it actually needs it, because then you're not wasting um, you're not wasting any durability. You're getting the most out of it. Oh, okay. Let's take the jetpack off. There we go. All right, so this is a full featured one. This should have everything that we need to buy and sell. Yeah, it's got it all, I think. Excellent. Okay, so let's start off. Um, here, let's grab what we made. I think it's probably still getting cooked up a little bit, but that's okay. That's okay. Oh, we can't carry all that. Let's, uh, you know, we're going to have to be selective. Let's. Oh, they need to. They need to work on uh, the interface glitchiness a little bit, but that's okay. Okay, what does this guy have to sell or buy? He will do the T2 stuff, the pulse rival rocket launcher, laser pistol. Lives. So he does the high end stuff. Heavy armor and the upgrade kits. Okay. Okay, so he won't buy any of the regular weapons that we made. Nope. Nope. It's got magnesium though. I think uh, I I don't have any money. Okay. So, <laughs> crap. Maybe maybe this isn't the right place. Let's see what they got upstairs. We might not be able to pawn off our weapons here. Uh, okay, we can get rid of our ore scanners that we made. So let's grab those. That oh, looks like it, eh? Yeah. Okay, well, let's sell those. Well, we got some money now, at least. We got some money. Okay. What about over here? What do we got over here? We've got... Oh, sprouts! Yeah, we can start getting a garden going pretty quick here. You know what? I think with the money that I just got, I'm gonna I'm gonna go for the sprouts right now. So let's get. Um, I don't want corn. I want pumpkin. 
buy all that. I mean, we, we could make a massive base now. And just do a super awesome garden and everything. And I want to find a nice island to do that on with a bunch of vegetation and stuff. Because that dinky little, dinky little piece of land sticking out of the ocean right now that I put a, a, a base on is not where we're actually building. Because that was just temporary for proximity to the trading station. Uh, so having said that, you know, I'd really like to have pretty much everything in my garden but right now we're gonna go for the basics let's get an aloe some aloe sprouts space oranges i mean i can go gather all this stuff but meh don't know about the mushrooms we might not be able to get the mushrooms spice and the big alien flowers okay i want wheat where's wheat and so mushrooms, wheat, aloe vera, space orange, big alien flower, spice, and pumpkins. That'll get me my emergency rations. That'll get me pizza. That'll get me hamburgers. That'll get me meds. I don't really need the coffee. Or the sweetener or the berries at this point. Um, if there's something interesting that we want to make that needs that in the future, we can we can go about getting that. Okay, so we can buy grow plots from them too. It's got the steel ones there. We can make all this now too, so it's not super critical. They're a little... They're a little expensive right now. We don't have a ton of money. Let's continue on. Let's continue on. Can I get oxygen from here? Oh, that's cool. <laughs> flavored oxygen. <laughs> it actually said flavored oxygen. Flavored oxygen. <laughs> yeah, it's funny. Okay. Uh, and we've already checked this guy out. Okay, so, damn. I don't, I don't know if we're going to get rid of any of our weapons here. That's too bad. I don't think this guy is going to buy much. Yeah, he's... He'll do our chainsaws. Oh! Oh, I don't have them on me. <laughs> I'm like, wait, what? Okay, so let's... I'm going to put those sprouts away. Where can we put those? You know, I'll just put them in the fridge for now. Just put them in the fridge. Eat one of our pizzas while we're in here. Okay. Um, let's sell that. Good. He'll buy five more, eh? Five more chainsaws. And they're... So that's another, uh, you know, 7,000. That's probably a good idea. Yeah. Um, so he's the guy with the large atomic bridges and matrix. I haven't found anyone to buy the to buy small ones from yet. That could be a concern, I think, because I think the small ones are needed for the uh, for the HVs and SVs, right? Ooh. I should be able to make... Oh, what the hell? Hang on. This is new. This is new. Yes! <laughs> All right! Quantum Star. Here we go. This is brand new. For all this stuff. Okay, so he's... Uh, his price is... Meh. He's... He's got pretty good price. Uh, the optomic bridge. Okay, so we know where to come get that now. Excellent. Okay. Sweet. Okay, I feel pretty good about that now. We can, um, if we get enough money. Oh, scared the crap out of me. 
Uh, if we get enough money going, we can uh, definitely buy ourselves the the equipment that we need to, uh, or the parts we need to make the extenders, the CPU extenders. Yeah, large. So this guy, between the two of them and the guy down on the planet, we're going to have no problem getting what we need. It's just, we just got to get the money together. Now, is this all? Yeah, we don't want to do that. Go on friendly in here and get shot up. Yeah, that would suck. Uh, crew. Oh, they're so expensive. They're so expensive. Okay. Let's figure out what these guys will buy here. and Get as much. Get, oh, <laughs> get out of my way. Uh, so he's going to do the chainsaw. We can't actually make the texture and symbol tool because that's old school. Um, EVA boost. Hmm. We might be able to make a couple of those. I think we do have some gold. Because one, I think it only requires one uh, bar. Yeah, let's figure that out. So it's going to cost, we can sell it for 5400 And can I get, oh, I'm too far away. I'm too far away. So let's let's grab the chainsaws anyway. Uh, right here. And, oh, I, okay, obviously I sold them all. I don't have any more to sell. So, does he do detectors? No. Okay. Well, let's buy this magnesium. 87. 87. Buy that. I know, it's expensive. It's the only way to get magnesium right now, though. Either that or those little bearing nuggets like I was talking about. On the planet. So that's really cool. The quantum star guy here. Excellent, excellent. Is this configured? No. Uh, extender. Get your mouse out of your vessel or base. Property of. Okay. Can we can we do anything with that? No. <laughs> this guy can't do anything right now. He's just deco. Can we use this? Yep. Sword o scanner. Decorative. Well, it works. It would work. It looks like it would work okay uh interesting interesting he did auto minor course too right yep okay so let's go make some five more um oh crap now i can't remember it was five more of the five more chainsaws and then we're going to see how much it would cost to, or how much we can get off a bar just cashing in coins, as opposed to making an EVA boost or a couple of EVA boosts. So let's go do that. So EVA boost at 48. What was it again? God, I have like my short term memory is completely gone right now. Uh, the EVA boost was we're going to get 54.22 out of it. Okay. Okay. 54.22. Let's go. Actually, here. Now that, let's just turn this on and go down here and get out of here a little quicker. Can we get out of here through here? Yes, we can. Okay, so let's do that. Oops. Yeah, we can't warp. Okay, make us some um, chainsaws. We want five, five of those, I think it was. And then we want, um, okay, so EVA, gold ingot. We don't have the gold ingots with us? Crap. You sure? What? Okay, I guess we don't have any gold. I thought we did. I thought we did. Okay, well, that's disappointing. Well, I'm going to I'm gonna let this thing construct. I'm going to sell these things to the guy, and then I'll meet you back down 
at the other trading station on the planet and we'll sell off what we can and then uh, look at potential places to start a base because I think I think I really need to get a base going before I actually expand on this CV because there's I want to make a proper base so let's go do that oh okay we are back on planet uh, landed back at the trading station um, the uh, CV took the weight like a champ uh, had no problems it, it, it barely even seems to be noticing the weight right now I know once it hits a certain threshold it's just gonna tank in performance so it's probably pretty close to that weight limit uh, so let's sell what we can that we made so this guy does all the big stuff right that's not what we want this guy is he gonna sell more oh, five? Oh wait He'll do shotguns, assault rifles. Okay, so he, he did reset. It's just that he has maxed out projectile pistols. Okay, whatever. Let's grab the stuff that we made then. So no pistols. We'll grab all the rest of the stuff. See if we can get it pawned off. Uh, running out of space. It's fine. That is... Fine. So, sell what I can there. Get rid of all these. Get rid of what I can here. As much as I can of those. Okay, that helped quite a bit. Oh, that's putting our numbers right up there. Um, now, one of these guys does T2 drills, right? Yep. So, oh. Well, that's not bad. 3K, I can build. I can build 12 of them. Ooh. Okay, that's a big number if I build 12 of them. So he'll buy that. And what else does he buy? Ore scanners? Ore scanner. Uh, six ore scanners? Okay. So 12 regular drills. 12 regular drills. Uh, chainsaw. This guy does chainsaws. What's his price like? Eh, seen it worse. I've seen a lot better though. I like to buy. I bought the last one when it was at 169, which is the best I've seen of that. So we've, you know, it's going to take us forever to get this money up, but um, yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build those drills. I'm going to sell it to the guy. I don't think I'm going to have enough to buy another Optronic Matrix, though. Does he sell the small ones? No, just the large ones. That's fine. Um, and then we're going to find a spot to actually build a base. I want... Okay, so what I want... I, it, I don't want it in their territory, obviously. I want kind of a mountain top available with a bunch of flat area below it. Whew, that's going to be hard to find, I think. Oh, maybe over here. And I want it at least in the northern hemisphere. So, equator or north. This, this looks potential over here. This looks like potential there. Some potential here that looks like a high plateau area. Okay, so I think we have some potential areas to go investigate to set up a nice big base or multiple smaller bases to, to comply with CPU. Now that we don't have to worry about base attacks, we can make multiple bases, right? And it's not gonna it's not gonna compound the base attacks. Okay, uh, well, I will. I guess what I'm going to do is I'm going to go completely multi-tool that our old base up and grab everything. See if see if the CV can actually handle it because that'll be a big that'll be the test. I mean, with all of the gear, with all of these concrete blocks on it, like it's it's really laden down right now. Like, look at this. 
you know, 761 tons. So if I can add more, you know, if I can get this up to 1,000 tons and if it can carry that, I'll be pretty freaking happy. I'll be ecstatic, actually, for a level 7 CV. Okay, so I will meet you over there after I multi-tool that down. Um, I mean, you guys don't want to sit there and watch me multi-tool. It's kind of boring. I do have a T2 multi-tool, so it won't take very long. But And then we're going to go to – I'll meet you over where we're going to set up the base. Okay? And we'll get that started. So I'll see you in a bit. Okay, we are back. And as you can see – we are on a island. Um, I just love this view. I love this view. Okay, so we can see islands off there. We're above like a forested area here. It's kind of a flat-ish enough area to build a platform on. Now, it's going to be a raised platform. I don't want to dig into the ground at all here. Uh, so we're going to have multiple bases connecting each other. So we're going to start off with just a platform so that we can get, um, you know, a, a elevation established for the rest of the bases. So what I mean by elevation established is I'm going to, I'm going to lay down a starter block and you know what, let's, let's get some base blocks going here. Let's get some, uh, you know what, you know what, let's even, whoo, you know what we can do. We've got the mats, we've got the mats. Yeah, because we, let's do this. Let's smelt a little bit of sathium, we just need a little bit. Oops, I can't carry much anyway. Um, so let's just put that into there, we've got Neo. Uh, we've got enough of the rest of the stuff here. Do we got? Yeah, we got cobalt. Okay, so it should be able to make a whole bunch of flux coils. Um, yeah. You know what we'll do? We'll just make an advanced constructor and pick up the the large one. I think. Oh, uh, you know what? No, because then it's a hassle. Let's upgrade that one. So here, let's jump out. We're going to upgrade this to an advanced constructor. So let's learn it. So base, we're going to learn a bunch of stuff right now. Get some basics going here. There we go. Get those learned. Medical devices. A bunch of this stuff I won't be able to make yet because I don't have the arrest rooms as goes you required. I don't need that yet. I, I'm hoping to not have to make any um, of these because they they're the ones that need the optical uh, optromic bridges two per and you need and you need to build two of these so it's four of those bridges to go up to a tier three and then four uh yeah four matrix because you need four of these right maximum of four yeah maximum of two yep okay let's keep learning stuff well you know what we we'll might as well learn that might as well learn that a lot of this stuff transposes over to capital vessel so Warp drive that, that, all this. Line. I'm not going to bother with the offline protection. That's a multiplayer only feature, really. A bunch of this learnt. We'll have to learn these. And then, need to learn a bunch of those. More wood, excellent, because we also want. Uh, we want the tool turret. I learned spotlights. Wow, that's incredible. Um, I don't know how that's even possible that I haven't learned. Okay, let's get some small vessel stuff going or hover vessel, I think, at this point. Yeah, we should probably... Yikes. You know what? Small vessel, because we need to actually level up still. 
It'd be easier if we can like make a better SV. A bunch of this is learns the um, for the the HV also. Thrusters, armor cockpit. See a bunch of these are, this, are for both. Okay, let's take a look at this now. Okay. Um. Sure, I learn all this stuff. Woo. Okay, so weapons, laser pistol. Oh, damn, am I going to ha not have enough now, right? Did I screw up? I need 40, 52 points. Crap! Thirty two, forty four. Yeah, I'm shy. That's fine. We'll learn rocket launcher. Um, that and that. That allows us to make the rifle. And we can at least make a rocket launcher. It won't be the, the, uh, the good type. The T2. I love the T2 ones. They, have, they actually have a pretty decent range to them and damage and speed. Um, yeah. They can hold six, which is not bad. Okay. Well, there we go. We spent our points like freaking crazy. We can go level up more once we um, <clears throat> upgrade our SV, I think. Let's build some base blocks. So we're going to build some base starters. Let's put that into the container controller. We have some solar panels, some basic stuff right now, but let's one, two, three. We're going to have at least three bases. And I guess what we can do, oh yeah, see we can build everything. We can build an advanced constructor. You know, that would be better if we... Here, let's cancel this. <clears throat> let's cancel this. We're just going to build an advanced constructor. I'm not, it's easier just to build another one. We're going we're gonna to need... We can put a large constructor down in the base and just upgrade that one then instead. I'd rather right now utilize the advanced constructor. We're probably going to have to build the CV CPU extender right away, though. Because the efficiency, the CPU efficiency is going to tank once I put this in. So that's going to suck. Okay, so let's empty our... Let's empty this out here. Well, I can just disconnect and reconnect. Okay. Um, yeah. So we just got to wait for this to build. Come on. There we go. Come on. It's got to make this stuff. We had looted a bunch of stuff, so it doesn't need to, to make everything. Just, just a majority of the stuff we used to make. Excellent. Excellent. Well, it needs to make two. That's it. A lot of sathium and that's 20 sathium holy crap plus all the other stuff that it's already put in i didn't realize it was so sathium intensive i thought it was neo intensive i think it is actually more neo intensive but we'll see okay excellent once this is made this will speed up the construction a lot like a lot Okay, so while that is constructing, let's reconnect. 
we are. Let's put some stuff down on the bar here. Let's let's put our base, get it started. We have a whole bunch of cement blocks too. So I'm probably gonna have to do this inside from inside. So let's do this from inside. And it looks like it's about the sun's about to go down too, yeah. That's okay, we can sleep. Okay, so basically what I want to do is I don't want to be digging. I don't want to be digging. So it's going to be a raised, elevated platform. But right here, it's not going to be raised so much. <laughs> It'll be like uh, just barely, just barely the height of that. So let's... Um, Say right about here. And no. It's not going to. We're too close to the other. Really? You gotta be kidding me. Come on. It, is this really? Can I do this? Yeah. Yeah, we're too close to the. Uh, <clears throat> That doesn't make sense. I, d I don't think we're that close. Oh, are we on? A... No, we're not that close to that either. <laughs> really? Where I want to build, it's not going to? But there's no reason why it shouldn't be allowed to build here. <sighs> Man, it's... Like connected, see, there's no connect. I'm not connected. It's just not letting me freaking build. I, I don't get it. I cannot do this. There is a resource deposit nearby. Try what? Oh come on! It's not that close. It's 300 meters. So what's the anti grief now? Like that's ridiculous. Do I gotta change that? Can I go in and change that? Cause that's this isn't functional. Do I got to mine that out? I don't think it's going to matter, is it? Because it, put it puts that funky zone in. Ugh. Well, this is a setback. <laughs> oh. Okay, I'm going to fly over there. and I'm going to see if I can mine it out to see if it'll make a difference we might have to we might have to come perch over here and build over here it's just that this was a nice flat area right here uh, it's really disappointing that is really disappointing oh, what a shame See, it makes those permanent anti-build zones for the deposits now. And then... And I'm not even in one. Like, that just seems unreasonable. Okay, well, that's fine. Figure it out. I, I really wanted this site, though. Like, there's... there's It's not a bit... See, it can just barely fly with all the weight. So I, I'm going to show you... That it can do it. So it's there we go. We're not cheating. We're not cheating. Only this is in the bar, which is not that much. But yeah, 1.46 kilotons <laughs> because of all this and all that water now. That's awesome. Okay. So she can lift off. She moves forward a little better. So aim up. Well, hmm. I didn't really want to do a big mountain top one I wanted to do more like a plateau with a good view and that was ideal back there that was just ideal that's disappointing that's really really disappointing I mean there's a there's a plateau over there oh uh, that's gonna be in Polaris territory yeah we're already in Polaris territory so you know that's a no-go. Because um, it won't let you build in their territory anyway. 
Well, crap. That just sucks. That just sucks. Um... Damn! Can we start it over here? Okay, so silicone is 400. wonder if we, um... if we can get it over here. Three hundred here. Let's uh let's jump out. I mean it looks like it's about the same direction really here. Let's just jump out real quick. Yeah. Yeah, it's not gonna let us, is it? It's not gonna let us. Okay, oh yeah, we're 300 meters now. We're 300 meters. So... So how far do we have to go then? Because that kind of sucks. Maybe we can do it over here on this... No, I think this was Polaris territory, right? Ugh. Well, this is a setback. I don't know where to build it now. I wasn't expecting such a big anti-grief zone for a deposit. Um, you know what? This isn't that bad. I can build up a bit of a tower, right? We'll have the sun come up there we can make a tower that looks up across you know this might not be bad right here okay so let's let's have a look let's have a look let's try land in here and see if we can um let's turn the lights on oh whoa 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 get the uh in the trees yeah okay but I think it's also nope we good we good we're good okay okay so let's uh let's shut the thrusters off it says we have 10 hours 37 minutes and we now have 12 hours and 40 minutes okay um, oh, really? Is it still not going to let us? Oh, no, it will. It will. Good. Okay, good. Okay, then. Good. Um, well, I guess we'll just put it up at the top here. Get it started. So... Sink it down, do a little bit of digging right there, I think. I think we can dig the the top of this a little bit off. Yeah. Yeah, we can do that. We can do that. Uh, although, I'd like to really... I mean, potentially, I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to do a lot of digging. <sighs> okay, is it going to let us over here? Yes. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay, okay. I think we're far enough away that we can get our three bases down and start this. So I'm going to start a tower, I think, right here. Or should this be our... Mm, you know what? Here, let's... um. Let's spawn the drone again.
Okay, so that's the high elevation area. That should be like the lookout tower. And then we need a flat area for the CV, right? So is that going to be right there? I think it is. We can make a, a platform there going across. Okay, so let's put the um, let's put the base starter down then. Let's get this down. Um, you know, I, I don't think I need to cut into the. I don't think I need to dig anything. Let's just put it sink it in a little bit, just a smidge. There we go. It's still higher than the rest of the hill. Good. Okay. Put it there. Oh, it nuked the trees. I don't think it actually nuked the trees, so I think it's like hiding the trees. I should have probably dug up the trees first. We'll see what happens. Let's um, grab some blocks. And we'll start getting this. Was placed. Let's um, here. Let's get this put down. We'll just get big chunks of it to put down right away. We can we can get it structurally sound later. Where's the critters? I hear critters. Oh, right there. Oh, he's all stressing about me. About my drone. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> oh, shush. I'll have to kill you later. Well, that's good to know. There's some uh, pests right there to keep us on our toes. Okay, so the object is to not dig. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think we want to. Bring that down. Just stuck. Just getting the structural integrity solid so I don't have any uh, any problems okay can we um what can we do to get rid of trees with the drone can we get rid of trees with the drones <laughs> cannot damage the target with this weapon so we are using another weapon so filler fine drill no Okay, that's not going to work. So let's do. Um, I don't know if it'll reach from here, but we'll try the defense mode. No, it's just hitting the. Uh, see it? It wants to. It's not quite. <laughs> nope, can't do it. Okay. So I have to get out to do that. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, so what do we need? We need us to come across further, right? Because we can utilize this ridge a bit. So let's do that. Okay, uh, I'll probably fill all this, it, this will probably all be solid. Actually, let's just do that then. Let's just make it solid. Okay. So 
So we'll keep coming out that way. He's getting a little bit annoying, isn't he? <laughs> Oh my. Okay. Oops. That's fine. That's fine. Get that across. And. So are we just going to do it a wall then? Let's put that down. Pull that. I mean, I guess it's big enough to park the uh, CV on now. Probably a good idea to move the CV so that we can uh, uh, knock all these trees down and continue to build that. Okay, well, I'm going to do that off camera. I'm going to continue to lay down a foundation for us to start the uh, to start the main base. Um, yeah, this isn't going to be where we're parking the CV. The CV is going to be down here in a different base. And we'll have it connected somehow. We'll, there'll be like, we might have a shaft that goes down that connects it up, I think. It would probably be kind of cool. Well, next episode, we're going to continue on building on the base. Um, because we really need to get a garden going and all this sort of basey sort of stuff, right? A furnace and a deconstructor we need like medical equipment we need the grow plots and the safer environment plus it would be a lot easier to use it's more fuel efficient because we can get the uh, solar panels up so till next episode you guys have yourselves an awesome awesome day <laughs>